Okay, we are- whoops. Okay, we are back to Goddess, an RPG Maker game made by a friend of mine. And we are fighting zombies. So you know that's good. Damn it all to hell! All the rocking has caused these barrels to roll everywhere! What a mess! I can't get to where I need to go! Well, let's fight some zombies. Sea Corpse! Times two! Uh, yeah, just do that like so. Okay, so, um. Hmm. You know, just. Just match the attack. We seem to be sufficiently... Well, I mean, they're hurting a little bit, but... They aren't doing that much damage, is what I'm saying. They don't seem to care about the apples! <gasps> Those monsters! Right. So, uh, no, actually. This is still a good idea. Um... Because, hey, double attack. Finish him off a little bit faster, you know? Case in point. Okay. Uh, and let's, let's go ahead and heal, maybe. Let's see, you have bandages, right? Hide yourself from enemies. Hmm. There we go. That ought to do it. Still just a box. Hmm. Oh, I cannot go around there. Well, okay then. Up we go. This one was conspicuously not moving, as if it was trying to deliberately block our progress. Wow. These zombies are assholes. Um... Then again, they are zombies. So, seriously? They didn't hit red. That's... oh well. Took no damage! How does that even happen? Uh, whatever. It's... dead now, but it was already dead. It's double dead! Seriously, who the hell would buy zombie oil? I really want to know. You know, I gotta say, I don't think you did your job very well. It's a zombie on a type rope! Come on! Seriously? Oh, okay, uh, she is hurting a little bit. Uh... Let's see... Um... Hmm... Maybe just, uh... She... Blitzen is kind of useless, isn't she? I mean... Yeah, she's kind of useless, isn't she? Little bit. Well, we are going to be swimming, positively swimming, hopefully not literally, in zombie oil by the time we're done with this. Can you, like, just be... thank you. Ah, this time it, it was you who did no damage. Take that! Don't I have, like, a god bow or something for red? I seem to recall picking up, up something to that effect. The dead are overrunning the ship! You'd think a god bow would be more effective. Then again, they are zombies, so you know, I guess just don't question it. On the other hand, they are zombies. They are clearly not, um... They are clearly not skeletons. Because a, a bow being ineffective on a skeleton, I would totally buy that. But zombies? They have flesh. Um, 
They aren't necessarily using it for much, but they have it. I... Hmm. I wish I had a, an ability to heal everyone at once. Wait, maybe I do. I don't think so, though. Oh, hey. Corset Titaner. Hmm. Well, okay, then. Wait, you say that about this box in particular? Oh, right, it's blocking the way down. The stairs. Right. Okay, so let's see. Oh, it's a tool. Okay. Corset lacings to tighten your dress and increase your bust exponentially! 90% chance to stun one enemy. You'd think that would you would think that would affect all enemies. Hmm. Well, whatever. Okay, hey, you know what? I can actually do that. Should have from the beginning. I should also heal up, perhaps. Um, do you have something that... Aha! Nope, it's dead. Okay, so... Oh, these do fixed damage? I mean, that's probably high, but... Well, I have bags of supplies. I still have the warm bread. Great. Truly great. Right. Uh, no. Not not you. There. Just, uh, do that, and that, and that. And the tools are... are empty. Actually, uh, we'll do that. Awesome. Now, we're... Hmm. Oh, hey, he's still driving the ship. Well, how diligent. You are a credit to pirate kind. Yes, let's go with that. So it would seem. What does he have in his hands? Is he a zombie? Yes, yes. It'd be just you and me now. I knew I wanted you the moment I saw you. So shiny. So enticing. My monkey. My beloved monkey! All that matters is this. Uh-huh. It called out to me. So I took it! But I will never sell it. No! It's far too precious for me! So, he seems to have been bewitched. What the hell is that? Oh, well, the guy on the wheel is dead. That can't be good. Uh, let's, uh, let's save. It's, it's the Banshee, isn't it? Unknown horror has emerged! Okay then, uh, let's just attack. Attack! Hmm. Actually, wait, no. Growl! Attack! Let's see if this works. It, it, it might be immune to stun, but... Nope, it's not immune. That is great. That is just terrific. Um, right, well, let's use that. Uh, hmm. Lowers defense for three turns. You know what? Hold off on that. Uh, 
let's see, how you you're not on shield up to shield bash levels yet. And we'll do that. Okay then. Still stunned. I think it just said it regained its wits though. Now use frenzy. You growl again. You can just attack, and naturally, you will tighten your corset again. It, this, this Cretan refuses to die! Indeed. Keep attacking. It has to die sometime. Nice in-battle, uh, cutscene. Is it still stunned? It didn't say that it woke up, so I have to assume as much. Mm. I kind of want to howl again. Although, I don't think it's like, you know, we'll wait one more turn then we'll howl again. I suppose like a shield bash as well, but eh, whatever. Stun is OP. Right, uh, no, not yet. Uh, now you will howl. You can attack, and you will stun it again. I mean, 90% effectiveness is pretty much worth, it's pretty much always going to be worthwhile, so, yeah. Um, like so. What? It, it hasn't even attacked! What? Tentacles? Uh, Hilda's more likely to be able to defend herself, I think. Blixen is kind of useless. Uh,. Oh, Hilda did take some damage, though. Still stunned. Uh, yeah, I think... We'll do that, and I think you will, uh, heal yourself. Kind of weird that Chance's Teeth made a V line, but, you know, whatever. Uh... You wretched god of death! Ancient horror of the depths! You'll never get it back! Presumably the monkey. Uh, indeed. Never! I will never take it from me! It will never take it from me. No one will! It's mine forever! Okay. Uh, what did she do? We had all but forgotten about Moffat, who had been hanging back during the fight. But she sprang forward, yelling at Litchfield in a voice I had never heard her use before. When she did so, the monkey statue flew from Litchfield's hands against his will, floating through the air and into the grasp of the tentacle monster. With a final look of almost understanding towards the vet, the creature retreated and sank back beneath the sea, taking its undead with it. We did it! And we found a strange tentacle. Hmm. Hilda learned Frenzy! It's gone. How indeed. I, I... I wasn't myself. I couldn't think straight. I... I... It's okay, Captain Richfield. It sounds like you stumbled across a cursed statue. It belongs to some old god, apparently. Ah, uh, yes. 
The Old Ones. I've read so much about them. Ancient creatures that exist in realms beyond ours. They're beyond our understanding, but apparently so susceptible to the hypnotic allure of my heaving boss. <laughs> apparently so. Oh, that's great. Uh, uh, is any of his crew left alive? The captain may have been confused by the creature and its statue, but I was even more confused by what Moffat has done. He spent the rest of the voyage in relative silence, and Moffat was back to her normal self. A few days later, we docked in the kingdom of Fathim. Yar! Twas a fine voyage indeed! Aha! Uh -huh. Ya, yeah, tis true! Tis true, lass. But looking at it from a relative point of view, twas fine indeed. You must have a terrible life if this was relatively fine. It, yep, yep, that, that sort of says it all right there. Indeed. We'll be off then. Safe voyages, lasses. And don't go raising right into ancient temples, I wouldn't. That does seem to be what, be what he's suggesting. <laughs> uh, mm hmm. So. And good riddance. Um. <laughs> Aha! Buckhorn Port. Mighty fine day, isn't it? What's that? You're looking for the capital city of Farthorn? Just head out from the port and go southeast. West. I said west, not east. I don't know what you're talking about. You can't get lost if you follow the road. You say that, but you would be mistaken. Hey there! I'm always looking to have a things to, looking for things to buy. Have anything to sell? Uh, you better believe it. Uh, you are selling medical herbs, but I have, oh, okay. I have so much stuff. Like, look at all this zombie oil. Fifteen zombie oils. I am figuratively. S oh yeah, also this thing. I am now swimming in ducats! Which, I gotta say, is a much more pleasant experience than swimming in zombie oil. Um, hello, stranger. Hello, traveler. Stay a while and listen. No, I refuse. Sure. I will stay. I did just find an elder god, after all. Also, there's a box! Well, that's worth at least 25 ducats. So, I'll just, uh, I'll just be going. Oh, well, okay then. Um, hmm. I stand corrected. It is, is indeed, you know, this is really more set. Wait, he did say Southwest, didn't he? Never mind! An orc and a goblin. Use the power of frenzy. All of the frenzy. Well, not all of it, really. Okay, I just saw that blitz, and you totally dealt no damage there. Aha! Now the other frenzy! Kind of odd that the dog does not have frenzy. But, you know, whatever. Don't sweat it. Uh, I will just save my game here. Oh wow, this place is huge! So this is what a real city looks like. Ah, it feels good to be back in civilization. Feel that stone beneath your feet. You don't get that in a small town like Wildershins. Uh... Mm-hmm. Quite, you. Pardon? 
Uh. Mm hmm. But I have a list of why none of that is going to happen. First, I've never been here in my life. Never left Kralin in my life before I moved to Wittershins. Of course you haven't. Mm hmm. Yeah. Probably should have claimed that. Er, uh, claimed? Probably should have brought that with you. Mm hmm. Indeed. Yeah, I suppose. I suppose. Ha. I, I guess I'll stop off here. Join me next time for city, more city exploring. Well, no, I don't think more is actually strictly correct here. It's just city exploring. In, in any case, until then, this has been Goddess with Kiss Blue, and have a great day. Bye!